All right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right and staying strong and solid in these times that we're in. I pray that you have repented and that you were baptized. I pray that you are safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting the good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow straight gate path and you help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you and that the Messiah intercedes for you. The spirit intercedes for you as well. So always stay thankful, grateful, appreciate it. Take it one day at a time. Most definitely. Let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another day to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, closing our back and a roof over our head. Let us thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out, guiding us through the morning, getting us through the afternoon, get us through the evenings, get us through the nights, the week, the weekends. He is constantly looking out for us with his grace, mercy, favor, love, the outstretched arm of God, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God, his word, his only begotten son who died for our sins. There's plenty of things the Most High God has done for us throughout our lifetime and continues to keep doing for us because his mercy is everlasting and his truth endures forever. Amen. So always keep him first. Always worship him. Thank him. Praise him. Call on him. Sing a song to him. Hearken to his word. Hearken to his voice. Trust him in everything you got going on in your life forever. Most definitely. Welcome, everyone. I appreciate all you for listening and support. It means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Let us always uplift each other in Christ and encourage each other in the Lord. Let us always pray for each other, intercede for one another, comfort each other, lift each other up. All those great, awesome, amazing things, people. Brothers and sisters of the faith all over the world, let us be together on one accord for the Lord. Amen. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all four corners of the earth, all the scattered Israelites among the nations, all ends of the earth. Much love to the churches and ministries out there with the sound doctrine, the peace, the love, the harmony, the fellowship, and the services. Much love to all the previous martyrs, the current martyrs, and the future martyrs, the brave, bold, isolated, courageous believers who are going through it for the gospel, who are being persecuted for the faith, who are going through many tribulations and hardships for his name's sake. Stay strong, steadfast, firm, and encouraged. We, brothers and sisters of the faith, are with you. We know the Messiah is with us forever until the end of age. Amen. So stay strong out there, people. Much love to the great tribulation saints down the road. Much love to all the grafted in Gentiles of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, faces, kinships all over the world. Much love to all the brand new converts out there, all the brand new creatures of Christ out there, all the born again people, the Holy Spirit filled people. God bless all believers, all walks of life, most definitely. Anyone who just repented, God bless you. Anyone who just got baptized, God bless you also. If you did not repent and get baptized, Go repent and get baptized ASAP immediately. Shalom, family, greetings to all of you. Welcome everyone, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faces, all kindreds, everybody. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. All the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fishes in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains, the insects. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted, grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the most high God. Sing a new song, clap our hands, thump our feet, praise him. Rejoice, always rejoice. Make a joyful noise, make a joyful sound, cry out to him, dance, express yourself, play an instrument. Do what you do for the most high God. He is always watching us, so always serve him with gladness and joy and always worship his spirit of truth. Amen. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God for your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Let us keep doing Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives till the sun comes back. Amen. He is coming back like a thief in the night in a twinkling of an eye. He is coming back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. Let us be alert, sober, vigilant, watchful, prayed up, washed by the water, by the word, the washing of the water through the word. Let us keep our lamp and oil. Let us stand our purpose and call for the most high God. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him. Let's seek his face. Draw near to God. He'll draw near to you. Let's obey the gospel. Let's obey the law, statutes, and commandments. Let's obey all of God's word. Anything the most has told us personally according to our life, our calling, our purpose, our situations, our gifts, our talents, our circumstances, handle it, people. Keep it all together for the most high God, most definitely. Keep the word of God. Keep the testimony of the Messiah. Keep the faith. Keep the law, statutes, commandments, decrees, precepts, ordinances, covenants, judgments, charges, observances, everything. Get a five-subject notebook. Get a pack of 24 pens. Get a Bible and write a whole copy of the Torah from Genesis all with the Deuteronomy by the job, by the by the tittle, by the line, by the precept. Keep it all together for the most high and embrace that new covenant. Amen. Stay encouraged, people. Stay strong out there. Okay. A lot of people going through a lot right now in the world. Uh, Prayers for people who are dealing with Hurricane Milton and different weather situations and stuff out of control. People hang in there and stay strong in those situations and put, and trust in the most high through it. Okay.
All right, so what I love to do today is go through today's daily devotional within the email. And then from there, I will close out with the prayer. I will close out with the priestly blessing. I'll close out giving all the praise, honor, and glory to the most high God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And praise his only begotten son who died for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah. So here we go. All right, so today's daily devotional, the prayer is based in Psalm 11, verse 4. It starts off with the scripture, Draw me not away with the wicked and with the workers of iniquity, which speak peace to the neighbors, but mischief is in their hearts. Psalm 28, verse 3. Mm, amen. Devotion based on Psalm 28. The Bible tells us prayer is the most effective way to fight our battles. When we cry out to the Lord, we can trust him to defend, protect, and sustain us through the night. And the good news is that there is no wrong way to pray. It is simply a matter of talking to God honestly from the heart. He hears every word we speak and releases his power to bring the help we need and the answers we seek. Now take a moment to clear your mind and focus on your focus your thoughts on God. Acknowledge that he is your rock, whom you can always count on to comfort you, sustain you, and uphold you through the night. He knows the weight of what you are carrying from today, and he is ready to lift your burdens and give you rest for your mind, body, and soul. Claim the promises in his word as your own and rest in their truth. Amen. Acts reflection, adoration, invite God's presence to be with you tonight as you sleep. Delight in his hope. Comfort yourself in his strength as his presence fills your room. Fill your soul. Find rest. Know he will lift you and keep you upon his rock forever. Confession. Think of a time when you took matters into your own hands rather than turn to the Lord for his help and strength. Ask for his forgiveness as well as help with turning to him first in the future. Thanksgiving, praise God for all the ways he provides for you as your help, your rescue, and your strength. Recall a time you felt the Lord's guidance in a tricky situation, how he guided you. Supplication, Father, be my stronghold and shield when I face opposition. Cover me with your grace when I face trials. Be my shepherd who carries me to safety in your holy presence. In your son's great name, I pray, amen. Most definitely scripture. The Lord is in his holy temple. The Lord is on his throne in heaven. His eyes observe. His eyes examine the children of men. Psalm 11 verse 4. Amen. The prayer. My God and King, you are my foundation. You are the stronghold for my heart, mind, and soul. You reign on a throne of righteousness and holiness. If you were to give me even a fraction of your presence, it would be enough to satisfy me for a thousand lifetimes. But you don't just give me a fraction. You offer me the fullness of who you are. While the wicked have fashioned their weapons to win the war of life, you have placed me behind you so I might behold your victory. It is a sweet and comforting thing to know I am safe in you. And my future is held firmly in the same hands that hold the heavens. I love you, Lord. Help me to sleep soundly in your loving arms tonight. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. All praise to the most high God of heaven and earth. Yes, he's the God of Shem. Praise the most high God. He is the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob. He is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. He's the God of Israel. He is the God of the Hebrews. He's the God of Jeshurun. He is the Lord of the armies. He is the God of Noah, Job, and Daniel. Hallelujah. Praise the most high God. He is the God of David. Praise the most high God. His only begotten son died for our sins, rose up three days later. Much love to the Messiah for sons, but for all of us, hallelujah. Praise the Messiah. Most definitely, much, much love to the Lord. Most definitely, he's the last Adam, the second Adam. Praise the Lord. He is the advocate. Hallelujah. Praise him. The almighty, true and living God. Praise the Lord. He is the Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atonement sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith, the author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the beloved son, the blessed and only potent, the blessed and only ruler, the blessed and only sovereign, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ the Christ of God, the consolation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, God is with us, eternal life, everlasting father, faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born of all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord. God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the head of the church, the heir of all things, the heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am. 
the image of God, Yehovah, Jehovah, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Shalom, Jehovah Nassai, Jehovah Rapha, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, King eternal. He is the king of Israel. Amen. He is the king of kings. Hallelujah. He's the king of kings and Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna, and the highest praise. Hosanna, the son of David. Blessed be he that comes in the name of the Lord. We have blessed you out of the house of the Lord. King of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader, commander, the life, the lie of the world, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness, the Lord is holiness, the Lord is my banner, the Lord is my portion, the Lord is my strength, my rock, my refuge, my good fortress, my high tower, my mighty, my mighty fortress, my healed, my, my, my healer, my shield, my protector, my salvation, my redeemer, my helper, our protector, our defense, our safety, our salvation, our redeemer, our provider forever, praise him. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Yahweh, Ben Yahweh, Ahai, Yeshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Shalom. Yeshua Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehosha, Ahai, Yeshaya, Adonai, Abba. He is the consuming fire. He is the father of heavenly lights. He is the father of the fathers, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His sons at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician, could cure all things, heal all things. He is the carpenter, could fix all things. With God, all things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rested on the seventh day. He could fix your situation right now in the name of Jesus. We touch and agree, y'all. Call on him, he'll show you great mighty things. Search and seek with all your heart and you will find him. He is a rewarder to those who seek him diligently. Know that he exists. Believe in him, trust him, know he could do for you. Abide in him, abide in his word. Ask the Father what you need in his son's name and shall be given to you. Healing, restoration, deliverance, miracle signs, wonders, hope, good news, unexpected good turnarounds, double portion of blessings, favor, things going in your favor. I speak favor on your life forever in his son's name, always forever, most definitely. Yes, we know that for the rest of our lives, the outstretched arm of God will be in our lives forever. The mighty hand of God will be in our lives forever. The finger of God will be in our lives forever. Most definitely, we are in agreement with the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. God is one. We walk by faith and not by sight. We're justified by faith in the Messiah. The just shall live by faith. Our faith has saved us. Our faith has blessed us. Our faith has made us well. Our faith is how we overcome the world. Amen. We serve an on-time God, y'all. He is due time and his timing is perfect. He got us, y'all. Just praise him, trust him, keep calling on him, keep seeking him. He got us forever. Yes, he's the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven. The man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God and savior, our holiness, our husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrificed Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection of life. The resurrection, the resurrector, the life, the life giver, the abundant life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the rule of God's creation, the rule of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman, the shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man, son of the blessed, son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator, the stone the builders rejected, the true bread, the true God, the true light, the true vine. He is the truth. Amen. He is the way. Hallelujah. He is the way, truth, and life. Praise him. The wisdom of God, the witness, the wonderful counselor, the word, the word of God, the word of life, the word of Yahuwah, the word of Elohim, the word made flesh, the living word, the word of Yehovah, the word of Yahusha. Hallelujah. Praise him. His word is purifying silver, just as David said in the Psalms. We know that every word of God is true, pure, and false. The book of Proverbs says, and we know that his word is a double as the book of Hebrews says. I mean, we touch and agree, y'all. The Messiah is the high priest of the order of Melchizedek. He is a sinless high priest. He's the everlasting king. He is the way everlasting. Repent and get baptized. Forgive others so that the Heavenly Father can forgive us. Write a copy of the Torah. Be blameless before the Lord our God. Circumcise your hearts before the Lord our God. Always remember that you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. With God, all things are possible. The Lord is with you. Who, who is against you? Amen. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. Hallelujah. Stay strong, people. Amen. Definitely. Prayers up for all peoples, all walks of life. Prayers up for all the poor people, all the widows, all the orphans, all the fatherless, the tribe of Levi, the strangers, the sojourners, the aliens. Prayers up for all the babies, the children, the young boys, the young girls, the men, the women, the single people, married people, divorced people, widowed people, single parents, co-parenting, prayers up for all marriages, all relationships, all household, all friendships, prayers up for the elders, the senior citizens, prayers up for everybody, all walks of life, most definitely. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the honor and the glory forever. Amen. 
The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his counsels upon you and give you peace. And they shall put my name on the children of Israel and I'll bless them. Shalom. Amen. Selah. Barakatha. I'm Jarvis Kingston. I love you all. Praying for you all. Peace.